Now, with your storm team weather, here's meteorologist Aaron Ayers, sponsored by Jim Bass Cars and Trucks. Let's take a look at the weather and what we saw today across the area. Taking a look at the time lapse from downtown San Angelo. Blue skies, much of the same as what we've talked about the past three days here. Some few little cirrus clouds there, but not much to see. There goes that setting sun, and then there's the moon again, setting off to the west here tonight, 75 degrees and clear out at the airport. Right now, we're sitting, our today's almanac, we're sitting at 87 for a high today. That's a little above average for us here in the Concho Valley. Nowhere near that record of 105, but we could get close as we come into next week. Today, our low was down to 44 this morning. Normally, we're about 55, so about 11 degrees cooler than where we normally are at this time of the year. But we are sitting at 70 degrees, 75 degrees out at the airport right now. Clear conditions for us. Humidity is at 33%. Winds out of the south at 7 miles per hour right now, so calming down just a little bit for us. Looking at the local radar, all of that green stuff that you see, that's not rain. That's not rain at all. That's just ground clutter that the radar is picking up on and trying to display it as something, but it's actually not anything falling from the sky, thankfully. Um, we're actually clear and calm for us tonight, and we're going to pretty much stay that way as we go into next week. Warm and dry week ahead of us. Record-breaking temps could be possible. We'll talk about that. Plenty of sun for us and slightly cooler as we go towards the middle of the week. Let's take a look at planning out our Monday for us. Plenty of sunshine for us. Temperatures getting into the upper 80s by 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Some clouds on your Monday, mainly in the afternoon and evening hours. So expect a few clouds here and there throughout the Concho Valley on your Monday. Here's what this looks like as we go into the future cast. Some clouds by 7 o'clock in the morning. Not very many, but few here and there throughout the Concho Valley with temperatures in the 60s for us here across the Concho Valley. And then as we roll this forward into the afternoon hours, temperatures getting into the upper 80s, maybe even some 90s for some communities with plenty of sunshine, a mix of clouds here. Some showers could be possible as we go into the evening hours on Monday. That's a very slim chance, but we'll still watch out for those as we go into the overnight hours on Monday. High temperatures for the next three days. Things are going to get warm for us starting with Monday, 89 degrees on Monday. Then I've got forecasted 100 on Tuesday, so we could get very close to that century degree mark. And then 85 on Wednesday, there's that little bit of a cool down by midweek. And it's a cool down from 100 degrees on Tuesday, which may actually turn out to be record breaking temperatures on Tuesday. We've got forecasted 100 degrees right now. The record stands right now on Tuesday at 97, set back in 2017. So we'll see if that record will be broken. Here's our extended future cast over the next several days. Here comes that weak cold front here. I don't think this is going to bring us any rain for us on Wednesday through the middle of the week. Just clear conditions, a little bit cooler than 100 degrees. And then we'll stay dry through the rest of the week. Into the weekend, some isolated showers could be possible as we head towards Sunday, but I'm not expecting much out of that either. I think the bulk of the precipitation stays to our east. But for tonight, we get down to 65 degrees under mostly clear conditions. For our Monday, it's going to be sunny, mostly sunny for us, and windy for us with those winds out of the south at 15 to 25 miles per hour. Otherwise, temperatures getting up close to 90 degrees on Monday. The next five days here in the Concho Valley, they look like this. Plenty of sunshine for us temperatures heating on up for us in the next five days. The seven day looks very similar with plenty of sunshine. Don't forget today, tonight is the last night for that sales tax holiday. You can find out more information about that on ConchoValleyHomepage.com. We'll be back on KSAN News.